Hey everybody, welcome to the Whiskey Warehouse. I'm Nick. I'm Dylan. Today we have a new release from Johnny Walker. It's been a little bit since our last Scotch review, right? Yep, just a little bit. I can't remember what the last one we did. Uh, oh, it was the... Uh, was the 12 year? The blue label. Okay. The Johnny yeah, Walker yeah, blue right. label. That Sam was the most recent one. That. Yep, he sent us that. If you guys want to check that out, $200 bottle, see if it's worth it. Yada yada. But today we have Johnny Walker High Rye Recipe Scotch Whiskey. Blended Scotch Whiskey. So this is from Johnny Walker, probably the most popular uh, Scotch brand in the world. It comes in at 90 proof, 45%. It's non-age stated, but I would say, what, at least four yeah, years? somewhere around there. And it's high rye, which means there's a lot of rye they use in the recipe, 60%. At least 60% rye. Okay, so our high rye contains a match blow of rye, barley, and wheat. Wheat, that's new. With at least 60% rye, the whiskey is aged in first fill and refill American oak casks at our bonded warehouses. So they probably age it first in a used barrel and then a new one or vice versa. Yeah. Something like Something. that. I, I don't know. But, it's got uh, a good color for, for being a rye. It does, yeah. A little darker than... I don't I think I've... Like the 12 year that we had was pretty light compared to... Right. I'm really interested. Go ahead and pour us up, dude. Alright. So the cool thing about this... <laughs> it's a basic bitch scotch. <laughs> oh, what do you mean by that? Uh, 30 bucks, I think, was what I paid. Okay. It's very cheap. That's a pretty good... Uh... Twist top. Good information to share, right? Yes. Like you said, I just released this year. Or was it last year? I think it was like early or late... 2021? Yeah, and then early 2022. Okay. Snagged this at the local watering hole. I, I think we looked at it. I sent you a picture. Like, this is interesting. And then it was like a month later. Snagged it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's... So, definitely piques my interest. Color? Um, gold? It's like, like, a, a, like a honey... Yeah. Like color? A, it's gold. Yeah, you're right. It's gold. Like a sunrise gold. You know, where it's like... It's very clear. Yeah. Not cloudy at all. Like a piss yellow. <laughs> Dehydrated piss yellow. It smells good. I can smell it from here. On the nose. I get honey and a touch of peat. I get like a little bit of, yeah, the, the scotchy kind of sense. That we kind of grainy. Yeah. Malty. That's what it is. Malted barley. They're probably using this. Apples. Apples, yeah. It's like fruity on the nose. It is like white fruits, pears, apples. There's a hint of rye. Like that. I don't really get much rye. No, just a hint. Actually, it's kind of overtaken by peat. It's interesting. It's got an interesting nose. It, it, it kind of just smells like the regular 12 year to me, but just a little more funky. It smells very sweet. And sweeter. Yeah. It smells sweeter. Let's get into it. All right, cheers. Very sweet. Very sweet. Nice oak on the back. Get some spice on the tongue. Mm. This is really good. Do you get that? A spicy tongue? No. Hmm. Might just be the first taste. I think I took a bigger swig than you did. <laughs> so really <laughs> coated the, mm. the tongue. I got a lot of like candy, like very sweet candy flavor coming out like right Ooh. off the bat. Yeah, that's a lot of candy. Like, like um, shit. Bitto honeys. You had those? Yep. It's very sweet, very honey like. Then it's kind of. It does have a rye bite. Kind of spicy, backside. yeah, kind of spicy towards the end there. The finish is nice. There's nice oak. Like, still I really like it. that. It's still light, though. It's light. Yeah. Yeah. It's like good. a front porch sipper. Yeah. It's good. Um, so, you know, do we want to read the notes off the side to compare? Um, sure. Or once we're done here, right? There is some oak on that. So a little bit. It is so sweet. Some vanilla, too. This is a good dessert, like whiskey. It is. It's very sweet. It's not what I expected. No. Like. It's not peaty. It's not. It's well balanced. 
I don't get a whole lot of rye except there's a little bit of spice on it, but it's mostly sweet, sweet all the way through until you get to the end. Yep, and that's when I I start to get my rye bite towards the end. Yep. I'm like, oh, okay, there's the rye. But you don't get any rye notes, no mints, no cinnamon, nope. nothing like that. It smells super peaty though. When you're when it's in the glass, it smells like whew. I know. That's gonna suck, that's but that's kinda, very tasty. <laughs> it is. It's like that's kind of the common theme with Johnny Walker's scotch. Is like it'll smell peaty and nasty, but once yeah. you taste it, like oh, that's actually that's pretty delicious. good. Yeah. All right. So our our nose should have been sweet wood spice. Okay. Fresh, cash, uh, fresh cut fruit, and cream of vanilla. Oh, well, we got the fruit part. Uh, the taste should have been green apples. Mm hmm. Rich toffee and dried clove. I didn't get any clove. I didn't get clove either. Uh, finished dry rye spice, which we actually nailed. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so. Not too good, bad. Good on us. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what do you score this, my friend? And then we'll do our bar, bottle, or bust. Um, as a whiskey or as, as a scotch? I would just say overall. It's overall. It's pretty nice. Um... Shit, I don't know. What do you think? Um, I'm thinking somewhere in the 80s. Yeah, I was thinking like mid 80s, like maybe upper upper 80s. I, I was, I'll say 87. Okay. I think it's really good for especially for the price. Um, and it being a Scotch, just kind of this is more bourbon esque to me than Scotch. It is. There's no Scotch. This is actually. I'm gonna put it at an 88. It's it's pretty good. Oh, I undercut you. <laughs> yeah. Um, I like it a lot. Yeah. I mean, the price isn't bad either. No. You, know, you can walk in, it's available. I'm actually really surprised with this, considering, like, I think the first time I tried it, it was not as good as it is right now. It's had this, some... So this would be like a bar, bo or buy it, buy the bottle. For 30 bucks, I'd buy it. Yeah. Yeah, for you're sure. a pretty good scotch for... 30 bucks? Yeah. No. Especially if yeah. you're not, like, a scotch guy. If you're more of, like, a, like a bourbon rye or a... Irish whiskey kind of guy. This is kind of like a good marriage of it, yeah, of kind all of hits. Those. It kind of hits all notes on mm -hmm. that. It's light, like an Irish. It's got that that bourbon woodiness a little bit, mm -hmm. and sweetness, and then the rye has got that spice to it. Yeah, so. great for like, like I said, dessert. This would be a good one, like with some vanilla ice cream or like some butter pecan ice cream. Oh yeah, this would be a really good treat. With that, that would be really good. Um, hey, Nick's not wearing one right now, but there is one over his shoulder over there. Um, we've got merch. Okay, and when you buy merch from us, it helps us build up the set, helps us invest in whiskeys, better materials, I don't know, everything. Yep, mostly whiskeys, more new whis whiskeys that we can review and for you guys to see how good they are. Mm -hmm. So the link is in our description under new merch, and then there's just merch. That's kind of like our, our merch store, but we are working on making a new, like, a uh, Whiskey Warehouse official website to where we will send merch directly to you. And each uh, shirt ordered will get a free whiskey sample. Ooh. Random whiskey sample. There you go. Yep. We got a lot. We do have a Between lot. Between the two of us, we have mm -hmm. a shit ton. I just got a like a huge thing of one ounce sample bottles, like 100 nice. of them, for like 40 bucks. There you go. So See? we're set. Yeah. He's ready. I'm ready. I just need to find out what shirts, because I want to get the best quality shirts for us. Then I have to figure out what design we want to do. Gildan. Those are pretty fucking great. They're, They're really like, scratchy. The, I want something the soft. The champion and, ones. Ooh, those are nice too. I got some connections through case or, sports. Uh, we can order them. Sonomas out of, uh, what's it called? Like this material, right? Like, we like that. Yeah, it's soft. Yeah. yeah Sonoma, that's uh, Cole's brand. Oh, okay. You go in there, it's like, they are, they're always on sale. You can get like two for 12 bucks or something like that. Oh, right. And they're yeah. good. Good quality. Is right? that that whiskey shirt? No, no, this is a... Just the plain? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, just look forward to that. And make sure to subscribe. Subscribe below. Help us helps us out a lot. Like comments on your opinion or review ideas. And follow us on Instagram at Whiskey Warehouse. Been really active on there lately. Go check it out. Uh, that's it for yeah. me. You got anything? No, I don't think so. All right. We'll see you guys in the next review. Bye.